Hi guys, uh, this is Kapil Sharma. Today we will discuss about uh, how we import blueprint uh, to make a car or an airplane in Katia V5. So let we will start. First uh, we open our uh, Katia window. Then uh, now window are empty. Then how we go for uh, to make a car or a aeroplane design so what window will we choose so first point uh, go to start button and then uh, go in shape and then second option is uh, sketch treasure so you click on sketch treasure and now your sketch treasure window will be open so second step now your view window in view window there is uh, one option it's isometric view and in isometric view there are uh, five to seven option so import the top view uh, side view or a uh, front view so there are uh, many views are in that uh, so this is the front view this is the back view this is the left view or a top or a side there are many views so first uh, we will uh, import our top view or a uh, front view so first step is go for a uh, first we select uh, front view then after that uh, put window again in this uh, toolbar then what we will do now our front pl plane are open now there is one option are there painting something are there uh, then uh, you go in this uh, toolbar now sketch treasure uh, in sketch treasure create a immersive sketch you click on this one and then uh, your uh, browsing window will be open uh, where you uh, put your uh, blueprints then you can search over there and then now i have a uh, going 7 uh, 8 7 uh, blueprints so now we, i will uh, import this one so in earlier i choose front view and then uh, i divide uh, some uh, blueprint in a different different uh, views front view side view or top view so i select front view okay then you see your front view of the aeroplane are import on my window but it is not seen so how we will see this uh, front view so uh, there is one option in view toolbar this one and then click on uh, setting with material when we will uh, select setting with material then your aeroplane window aeroplane front view will be shown so how now now next step what next step it is so now you seen some uh, numbers are on your screen and then uh, some planes also there uh, this is the uh, vertical plane this is the horizontal plane now if when you click over here at uh, meet your horizontal plane or a vertical plane this point you will click on that and you will move your uh, planes anywhere so what you will do for uh, importing front or uh, front plane now you zoom in then your vertical plane should be in a mid section of the aeroplane it's a necessity and then over if you click over here and then you will move your cursor vertical plane like this and then uh, if you click over here and then you move your cursor like this then your window will be like this now i told earlier that it is a necessity to put your view in a uh, mid of the aeroplane so what you will do you select your cursor and approximate you will put your uh, cur view on the mid of the aeroplane so and then this is your area will be covered and this is your area now you will put uh, some dimension over here like uh, 250 mm and 
over here you will put a 400 now if you put 400 over here then it will automatically will be changed so you uh, note these uh, two dimensions because it will uh, use uh, after some time mm -hmm. so you will uh, note this dimension horizontal plane or a vertical plane so suppose i uh, note this one uh, for on a horizontal plane 255 for uh, 8 and 35 on a vertical plane so now okay now your front plane your front view of the aeroplane will be shown on the screen now how we will import top plane or a side plane then second option second step is you import side plane or a top plane first i will uh, import side side view so what you will do uh, you select uh, side view over here so this is the right view or a left view you choose any one left view or a right view it's a de depending on you but i choose right uh, view so now uh, how, what you will do for right view now again you go for this option this is and then uh, check you choose side view so your side view will be open and then again this uh, cursor will be come and then uh, you reach your according to your requirement like this and then you move your vertical plane also like this now now you note some dimension in uh, front view then uh, this is the vertical plane in your front view then over here you put again 255.835 uh, dimension over here then again it will uh, again it will uh, change automatically in on your vertical plane again you noted this uh, vertical sorry horizon, horizontal uh, dimension then uh, this is your seven fifty point two three six, and this is your two fifty five point eight three five. So now your uh, side view also import. You can see uh, to move like this, and then now last step is to import a top view. Then again you go in this uh, view toolbar and then uh, select top view now this uh, view will be open like this and then again you go for uh, browsing your uh, blueprint select top view now your front views this is your front view this is your side view but uh, you can rotate this one like this also and then it should be you see this line are not straight so you should keep your uh, line should be straight like this now this is straight and then uh, you put your cursor in the middle of the aeroplane not exact but approximately uh, mid section and then uh, you will move uh, this plane till this this point and uh, this point will be this point and then uh, in uh, side view you should you take one dimension that is 750.236 uh, now it is reverse so you will put uh, some minus value so that it will come in a reverse direction so you will take minus now it will fine so now you seen your blueprint are uh, import uh, properly so this is the three to four step to import uh, blueprint same procedure uh, you will use uh, in a cars also but uh, this is the airplane uh, in next video i will uh, show you how we import uh, blueprint for a car also but uh, this is for uh, airplane so now you can uh, trace the boundary uh, in a uh, go to in freestyle mode and then you can trace uh, easily uh, this now you can trace easily uh, 
lines on that aeroplane and you will make easily aeroplanes so thank you guys uh, this is my uh, aeroplane uh, how to import blueprint this is a video for you so thank you guys and this is my uh, contact uh, this is Kapil Sharma I am a design and development engineer and my mail id is kapil uh, arch kapil and kp1995 at the gmail.com so you can contact on this uh, if you have some doubt in uh, regarding design and development so you can contact me on same email id and then uh, and then not forget to uh, if you uh, like my video then, then not forget to the like or subscribe my video so thank you guys